My name is Andrew Joannu. I have I had severe Tourette syndrome and I had deep brain stimulation done by Dr. Brian Capel at Mount Sinai Hospital in New York City. My name's Andrew Joannu. If you don't know, I'm well, if you don't guess, I'm a I'm a British Englishman. I'm 40, 45 years old. I have severe Tourette syndrome. <laughs> I had it for 38 years. Um, <coughs> I've always had severe Tourette. from 6 p.m. till 4.30 a.m. continuously when I went to bed and kept the whole house awake. And then I went to residential school because I couldn't deal with home life. Um, and then I got diagnosed at the age of 13 in 1981 and put on high doses of Haldol, which knocked me out for six years and I slept my education through. So I didn't have an education. I had every tick in the book, meaning the cursing, the spitting, the physical ticks. Um, I still have some ticks now, but it's still only days for the, for the programming. I've been beaten up a lot on public transport in the street because of the cursing. I shout racial slurs out and I've been to churches that have allowed me in the church or or thrown me out of the church because of the noises or I've been accused of being um, what's the word? demonic or had demons because they don't want to understand bullying from bosses and co-workers that I could no longer deal with. There was that problem and also the ticks were physically hurting my body which I really couldn't deal with. So that's another reason I, I went for DBS because the other drugs caused me more problems with side effects than, than the Turex itself. Andrew's got two electrodes that have been implanted into his brain. Um, and the, the leads have been tracked along his scalp into his chest and he has two uh, battery operated pulse generators that these leads are attached to. And now they're not sure so. <laughs> <laughs> In the end, I decided I have to do this. One, because I'm not getting any younger. And if I wait too long and I and get too old, I'm going to wish that what if it worked. I would say there's probably 75 to 80% better in his ticks. And for me, I think the advantage and the best thing 
has been not seeing him injure himself. He used to punch himself in the forehead. He would slam the countertops. And when he walks, he literally would stumble on every other step. And after his first programming, the first thing he said was, I want to take a walk with my wife hand in hand because we've never been able to walk hand in hand. As soon as he got home, he and I took a walk for 20 minutes. I'm very happy and feel that going through DBS is the best thing I ever did.